The plant supplies the district with heat and feeds electricity into the public grid. As fuel, the plant uses wood chips from the municipality's management of its trees and shrubs. They are delivered in lorries and tipped into a feed system, which in turn feeds the plant. As wood chips are a CO2 neutral, renewable fuel, the plant produces green energy. A chain conveyor transports the wood chips to a furnace, where they're incinerated on a grate under controlled conditions. Incineration produces flue gases of about 1000 degrees C that are led to a steam boiler. In the steam boiler, the flue gases give off their heat and are cooled to a temperature of about 180 degrees C. After going through the boiler, the flue gases are cleaned. The first step is to capture the large particles of ash in a multi-cyclone. Then a bag filter is used to capture fine ash particles. The dust-free flue gases that come through the bag filter go to a denox reactor where their NOx concentration is drastically reduced. The clean flue gases are now led through a flue gas ventilator to a flue gas condenser. The last remaining energy is extracted from the flue gases by further cooling them to about 50 degrees C. This step significantly increases the plant's efficiency. The clean and cool flue gases are discharged through the chimney. The heat the flue gases have given off in the steam boiler is transformed into high-pressure steam, which is led through a pipeline to a turbine. In the turbine, the pressure and the temperature of the steam are converted into shaft power output that is used to drive a generator. After the turbine, the expanded steam enters a condenser where it is cooled further and condenses, thus generating heat. The heat released from the steam condenser and the flue gas condenser is introduced into the district heating system by means of pumps. Two gas boilers can be brought online as backup or to meet peak demands for heat. The electricity generated by the generator is fed into the grid as green energy. If there is no heat requirement from the district heating system, the heat from the steam condenser can be cooled via a cooling tower so that the turbine can continue to operate. The Meerhoven Bioenergy Plant converts sustainable wood chips from Eindhoven Municipality into hot water and electricity in a highly efficient and clean way. With the arrival of the bio plant and the supply of renewable heat and green energy, the residents of Meerhoven can turn on their central heating and their lights knowing that they will be minimizing their environmental impact. This plant contributes to make Meerhoven one of the leading sustainable developments. Technology is the key factor on the road towards a sustainable future.